Post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD, represents a profound disruption of neurophysiological processes responsible for threat perception and impulse control. In individuals with PTSD, the amygdala, the brain structure that governs fear and aggression responses, exhibits hyperactivity, while the prefrontal cortex, which mediates rational inhibition and moral judgment, shows reduced activity. This imbalance creates a state of perception Consistent internal anxiety. The body reacts as if danger is ever present, even when the threat has long passed. PTSD can develop not only in response to prolonged physical trauma, but also as a result of sustained psychological or informational stressors. In some cases, this chronic activation of the stress system, particularly when combined with other psychological and social factors, can contribute to deviant forms of behavior. When an individual individual repeatedly experiences helplessness and loss of control, the brain seeks ways to compensate, to reclaim a sense of power over the situation. If the trauma involved physical or psychological humiliation or threats to life, this compensatory drive can manifest in highly destructive behaviors. There emerges a compelling need to overcome external suppression or even to retaliate, sometimes through domination, control, or other destructive actions. Such behavior does not appear suddenly. It develops gradually as a result of neurophysiological restructuring, reflecting the long-term adaptation of the brain to chronic stress.